Oh, I got that. Oh. I got electric shock off the car again then. Thing. Here we are. Mount Fuji. <laughs> Lovely shot, mate. Look at that. Shame about that truck here, but... Ooh. That lovely bit of road coming up. All of the curves. So, as crashing party goes, um, we have Larry Chan just up here, Hoonigan, as you guys may may not know. Um, we've come to HKS because it was sort of over, we were going over the mountain pass of Fuji. Uh, this is obviously Fuji Mountain. And by accident, we've actually walked in on Larry Chan's uh, YouTube video for Hoonigan, I'm assuming, and um, a photo shoot with uh, the R32. We're gonna leave them to it though. We're not gonna get in, involved in their sort of stuff. So we're gonna go around these quickly just to show you guys exactly what's going on. Josh and uh, Rob are absolutely losing their minds and so am I at the moment. We get, um, well, we've accidentally walked in. Thank you so much to HKS for actually letting us um, just have a look around these things, getting a bit more personal with them. But look at this Advan liveried Supra. Mega, mega thing with all the carbon. Look how wide these things are as well. Mad. Rob getting the f pictures in there. Come around to this one. This one has so much forged carbon. I tried to get this Toko Auto Cell on, but there were so many people around it that I didn't get a chance to actually properly look at it. And as you can see, look at all this down here. Absolutely mega. With the arches. Just come around on the arches. Look at that. I think this will probably be the, my favourite kit, other than probably TJ Hunt's kit. You can see so much tyre at the back as well full forged carbon at the back let's get a quick shot of that wow and again tried to uh look at this <laughs> tokyo auto salon and as you guys if you've seen the video didn't i didn't get anywhere near it basically i tried to get a couple of shots but it's really really hard so it's so nice to see it actually in person look at the size of the endless brakes on the back of it absolutely insane have a look on the front wow for, oh, look at this, right? So, forged car mirror with the forged car roof as well. I love that the new Supra, and I didn't notice it until I drove one and sort of seen a couple about the bubble from the top. Looks really cool. Absolutely mega thing, that. And HKS Supra in the original HKS livery, just like the R32 out there looking mad i mean look right let's just take a moment to have a look at the front camera on this thing absolutely mental and this has got the same i think it's the same kit or a, a similar kit to the white one where you've got so much girth you can see right through to the tire and that look at the mirrors on it as well with full on like the inside you can guys just see the inside mad and then come around to the back Huge wing, just like the Advan liveried one as well. Absolutely massive. I love this bit. I didn't notice this bit. The Tokyo was hang on. This bit coming off the white Supra doesn't have it. This one does. <clears throat> Looks very cool from that sort of angle with this uh, sort of rear canard, I suppose. It's very, very cool. Loving the uh, Supra logo in at the back. Keeping the uh, Supra vibes. Look at that, what a thing. But yeah, <laughs> as uh, accidental walk-ins go, massive thanks to HKS because we've literally just turned up, so very, very nice to let us actually video and take pictures here. And shout out to Hoonigan, Larry Chan and all that. I'll try and get a chat with him in a minute, but they're working. I'm uh, on the holiday enjoying myself at the end of the day, so yeah. Just wanted to bring this bit of uh, footage for you guys because what a experience to just pull up and I, I don't recommend doing this and don't don't go and do it by accident or whatever but yeah this is complete accident all the cars was out very very cool but yeah we'll try and get up there at the um r32 in a minute with the mountain that'd be pretty sick <laughs>
so um, we've just got permission to come into HKS's secret uh, hall of a uh, little bunker bit of uh, cars. I won't, I won't talk too much, I'll just show you guys exactly what's going on in here. I can't believe I'm in here. This is insane. HKS bike there, look at that. Right, back in the car, that just happened. So I don't preach anyone to ever do what we just did. So we've gone into HKS and just, uh, we wanted to find a gift shop on anything. That's exactly why we went there. Wanted and a gear knob. You wanted a gear Literally, we went there to get a gear knob. We were already in Fuji, so we thought we might as well. So we got to, I, I didn't do a lot of context in the part of the video where I couldn't do a lot of context, there was a lot going on. But yeah, we got to go into the actual like heritage bit of HKS, which is unbelievable. I've ne I didn't even know that was there until we started talking to the guys. So massive thank you to HKS. They absolutely just were so inviting when I said, you know, about you guys maybe wanting to see a bit of that content. They were like, please come this way and let's, you know, show you guys exactly what's in there. So, um, Hoonigan Auto Focus. Obviously, Larry Chan was actually behind us. I didn't get a chance to get him on camera and stuff, but that was one of those things. I, we, we'd seen him uh, sort of posting pictures and stuff, and yeah, completely by accident, he was there as well. So we got to meet him. Absolutely phenomenally nice guy. Absolute shout out to him. He's like the nicest down to earth person. We were just chatting and having a laugh and stuff. So, but I didn't want to throw the camera in people's faces. I hate doing that. So, um, yeah, that was really just like an awesome experience, wasn't it, lads? Just honestly, such such a good time. But thank you so much to HKS. Uh, this was not sponsored by them or anything. This was just like a complete accident when we actually smashed it. So, so happy with this video. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, guys, from us in Tokyo. Bye.